Hi, I'm Malcolm, the developer of the When I'm Home app for watches running Wear OS 3. You might remember that once upon a time, you could ask Google Assistant to remind you to do something when you got home. In other words, set a reminder to trigger by location. Google removed that feature some time ago, which is a shame because while I'm out and about, I often think of things I need to do back home. So I wrote the When I'm Home app to enable me to record a quick reminder to myself which automatically triggers when I'm back home. Today, I'm going to show you how to install and use the When I'm Home app on your Wear OS 3 watch. We're going to use my Wear Installer 2 app to sideload When I'm Home onto this Galaxy Watch 4. Firstly, let's enable ADB debugging on the watch. So settings, developer options, ADB debugging turned on. And now let me bring in my phone and open Chrome. And we're going to download the When I'm Home app from the Freepop website uh, that you can see here. So I'll include the links in the notes of this video, but when I'm home and file downloaded. So now we can open Wear Installer 2. Here it is. There's some explanation here as to how uh, ADB debugging uh, and installing apps uh, works, but the main thing is to make sure that the IP address of your watch is shown in the um, in the box just here, and I've already put it there, 192.168.1.214. Uh, yours will be obviously different from that. I can now press the Done button. And now we can use the custom APK option here. And it shows us the uh, APK files in our don downloads folder. And when I'm home uh, is here. Uh, we just downloaded this a moment ago. So let me tap on that. It's telling me the APK file is for Wear OS. Continue. And let me say, okay. So now I have the option to install. Sending to the APK file to the watch. Should just take a few seconds. And success APK installed on watch. So I can finish. I get a reminder to turn off ADB debugging on the watch to save battery. Let's just do that. Turned off. Now, if we look at the list of installed apps, we can see when I'm home here. And let me tap to open it. We get a message to explain what permissions the uh, the app needs. Um, allow when I'm home to access this device's location. Obviously we need that. And allow when I'm home to record audio, we need that to record a message. So we'll allow that. And you can see three icons here. Um, and let's, uh, let's go through each one in turn. So the first thing is to let the app discover my home location. And I'm at home now, so I'll just tap this first icon. Getting location, please wait. Saved home location. So the app will now remember my home location for the future. Now let's tap on the third icon for settings. Here we can set how frequently the app checks our location to see if we're at home. By default, it's every 15 minutes. We can change that if we want to. Next, we can set the distance tolerance. By default, 
If you are within 50 meters of your home location, you'll get a notification with the message that you recorded. And finally, if we set this switch, the app will also speak our message after posting the notification. So, Remember to allow when I'm home to post notifications on the watch in your companion app, in this case, Galaxy Wearable. Finally, let's tap on the microphone option. Now, before proceeding, the app will check that it has permission to find your location in the background and we'll need to set this permission explicitly. And it's taken us to the relevant settings page. So if we go to app permissions and if we look at only allowed while in use, we should find when I'm home there. Let's tap on that and let's change the access to allow all the time. That's important because the app needs to check periodically your location uh, from the background. So we're going to back up until we're back in, in the app. So now we're done with the one-time setup process and we can tap the microphone option and we can record our message or reminder for when we return home. When I'm home test. So I get a message to say message recorded and uh, we'll get this, uh, this message. The app will send a notification with this message when we return home and optionally it will speak the message on the watch as well. There's also a tile that you can use if you want a quick way to record a message. So I hope this free little app is useful to you. You can find links to my Freepop website in the notes to this video. That's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.